hello everyone and welcome back to another video with me um i'm here i keep hearing collective read i wanted to do a divine feminine but i'm going to do um you know just a collective reading this is basically a general reading i'll be getting the energies and seeing what's going on with y'all and you know what we need to know and what we need to work on and stuff like that so yeah let's let's begin let's tap in Take a deep breath in. Out. Begin one 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 on the timer. So yeah, let, let's begin. Let's begin. <clears throat> All right. So spirit messages do you have for the collective for today? For my viewers, for those who watch my channel, what messages do you have for um those today? Ooh, we have descendant invitation. Mm. Yeah, invitation. Because you know, earlier I was here. I know I was just fooling around. We have the sun source card here, and I heard. I'm calling you to go higher. So this could be some sort of um invitation here, from a source here. It's like they, they want you to go higher higher in something yeah think with this palas itena pala yeah that thing okay, so they're, they're calling you to go higher here you could be really connected to source here you could be thinking about something you could be thinking about what this is here or you need to like it could be like right there in front of you here it could be something that you need to do also in order for you to like ascend higher here yeah but there could be something opposing you or coming against you heard cause some opposition here all right one more spirit one more Thank you. And we have expand. Look at this. Sagittarius. You could have Sagittarius in your chart. You could be a Sagittarius watching this video. You could have it anywhere in your birth chart. And if you want to look up your birth chart, it is in the description box down below. Yeah. Also, if you are interested in donating to my channel, um, you know, the information is down there too. So, yeah, look at the bottom of the deck. I just saw 333. Three. <laughs> at the bottom of the deck, we have abundance jupiter so most definitely there's some expansion here but yeah as i said you're being called to to go higher so let's see what this is about spirits messages do you have for my viewers my collective Yeah, King of Wands. Yes, a step, step in your power. This leadership role kind of energy here. Could be a Aries, the Sagittarius. Most definitely, this is a masculine energy here. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm hearing like you're being called to lead here, but you could be holding back. Yeah, this could be. Uh, let me see. What's going on, spirit? Hierophant. You put a hierophant. But yeah, this is a hierophant. The high priest in the reverse. Mm. Yeah, you could be feeling trapped here, stuck holding. Or there could be a lack of something here. Or, or, mm, yeah. 
Uh, this could be a person that's in your energy here. Somebody could be going through some sort of um, ascension here. Also, I'm getting like some sort of changes in their finances here due to possibly some sort of um, bad advice here. Or this could be due to someone being disconnected from source. That's why they could be experiencing some sort of luck here. So they're being called to go higher. Take it as a resonance here. Yeah. But yeah, page of wands. The page of wands is communication. This could be like a good news. Yeah, most definitely some message coming in towards somebody or some downloads here. Mm -hmm. About a passionate new beginning, a, a new project here yeah. with the ace of wands. Um, you could be dealing with a Taurus, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Energy here, yeah. So uh, we have a Scorpio a Tower. We have the Tower card here, right? So there could have been a sudden upheaval. Wait one second. In a situation, yeah, with an Emperor, with a boss here, with some sort of authority figure see what's going on here i mean somebody could be intimidated yeah somebody could be juggling something here as i said regarding finances somebody is just uh, let's see what's going on negative influence seven of pentacles so okay so somebody yeah Invested in being deceptive here. Yeah. <coughs> they could have snuck around to do something. What's going on here, spirit? Mm. Strength card. That is the strength card. could be dealing with a Leo but the strength strength card just speaks of somebody you know um having courage here basically standing in their strength standing in their power overcoming something come on spirit come on this is just the help for my collective spirit Messages you have for my collective. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Somebody could be experiencing some sort of blockage here. Mm. If the fourths, I'm going to put this back in the deck, but this came out. But this is for somebody here. But somebody could be tired of dealing with a queen of swords this could be somebody that they have a family with or somebody that they um yeah have established a connection with here i don't know say that as a reason it's uh yeah. what you got to do now let's go Yeah. <clears throat> also, somebody could um want to message somebody here, possibly to offer them some sort of partnership relationship here. Yeah, somebody wants to put in effort in a situation. Mm -hmm. Somebody, um, somebody could be working hard on something here. Page of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody could be also working on like giving you a gift uh, presenting some sort of offer or gift to you here but it's like due to their finances or because they're like juggling back and forth here yeah they only can do like something small for you all right I'm getting like this this could be a fire sign looking as I said that this could be an Aries Emperor. Yeah, but somebody is um trapped in their head. But what they invested in here, they took the advice from a wrong person here. 
or it's like somebody did not seek like yeah somebody did not seek like some sort of higher guidance or some sort of some sort of influence some some yeah i don't know i can't find the word Sorry, but two of swords. Somebody could have been indecisive also. Not knowing which way to go. Not knowing what to do concerning something. Something could be being brought to light about a Queen of Swords. You have the Sun card here. That somebody could be in a relationship with, take it as a residence here. But some sort of. Oh, or this could. Yeah. Okay, I see what this is. So this could be some sort of incoming communication coming from a Queen of Swords. Possibly about a person they see as the Queen of Pentacles that wants to partner up with you. So it's like somebody here could want to like get to you first. Yeah, because something ended here. Mm -hmm. Something was long overdue. There could have been like some sort of um, painful ending here. <clears throat> yeah, seven of swords in reverse. Somebody was caught doing something. Yeah, somebody health could be effed up. I don't know, but somebody could be having health issues at this time. Chariot. So yeah, somebody wants to move forward here. Somebody could be traveling or somebody does not know if they should move forward or not. Yeah, because somebody's in regrets here. Possibly about somebody moving forward or communicating with you. Yeah, but there's a lot of drama here. Could also be like some sort of argument going on. Yeah, but possibly somebody wanting to like celebrate something here or reconcile. What is this? A sister. My sister of cups. <clears throat> we have the two of ones in the reverse. Yeah, somebody refusing to make a decision about something and or someone. Yeah, somebody wants to come forward with the Knight of Cups to make an offer. This King of Cups, this person could be in love with you here. Oops, oh my god. What's this? Yeah. <laughs> hey. This could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, but the sign don't matter. It's just the energy. Hey. Yeah, somebody wants to reconcile. So, but it's but like they don't know if they should come forward or not because this person is most likely still in a toxic kind of low vibrational energy. Or this person could be obsessed. <laughs> Hold on one sec here. Oh, baby. Baby. Anything else? Yeah, what did I say? Something has came to an end here. It could be regarding um some sort of toxic cycle here, but something somebody closed out a cycle with somebody here. Let's get a few more. Let's see, yeah, somebody walked away from something and or someone. Possibly that what that they were giving to judgment has been called on a situation. Yeah, something was very burdensome here. Yeah, somebody was like somebody's like um okay, yeah, so somebody could be could have went like in introspection mode here, in hermit mode here. And I'm figuring that they could have gotten that like, the indication here or some sort of clarity that they need to move forward here and to possibly reconcile. One more, please. Wait, one more. But yeah, something was like. 
all right, some, all right, all right because all right, for somebody else here it's difficult for somebody else here to come forward and make some sort of offer here or make amends here if the ace of pentacles i knew a blessing is coming towards somebody here and it could be from this king of swords mm, gemini libra aquarius masculine energy yeah the, this person is being sent from the divine and, and and i'm taking this as an indication here regarding that this fate of swords is, is in the reverse this person is no longer holding back here or is going to withhold some sort of communication here because yeah they were yeah they see you as the empress and the ten of cups nice 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 that's good all right i'm gonna get some advice from spirit from these cars and i'm going to end the video advice for my collective advice for my collective Oops. look out of the woods you've made it through what newness is emerging so whatever cycle you were in here whatever toxic cycle you were in you have made it out of it and something new is coming towards you honey yeah look to receive you must release what can you let go of what do you want to receive baby so somebody has been doing the work yeah, yeah. somebody been doing the work doing the work oh look <clears throat> look eliminate distraction stop shining light on things you are not how can you reclaim your power yeah so you need somebody to um get focused right now on the bottom of the deck we have forgiveness will set you free what do you need to forgive yourself for so you know take it as a residence yeah mm -hmm. we we you know we we are not perfect you know we're human beings we make mistakes sometimes and things happen in life where we just have to learn from those mistakes and move on you know so not only do you need to forgive others but forgive yourself also because if you don't forgive yourself like that's where it's at baby it's all about you forgive you love on you baby <laughs> all right all right so spirit give me some love messages for my collective please and thank you some love messages for my collective look yes the healing healing imagine yourself and your beloved surrounded by light Feel a relationship being healed this very moment. So, yes, some of y'all could be going through a healing process at this time. Or you will be, or you will be healing with a particular person that's coming into your life. All right. Messages for my collective. But we have trust this flip out that had for you. <laughs> we have trust transformation of course through acceptance. Once you accept the current situation, it will automatically transform. And we have look. Twin flame their passion ignites. Oh my god. We have at the bottom of the deck, let there be closeness between you, but always give each other space. Love never claims, it simply allows and gives. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, that's it for your collective reading. Take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Alright, so I'll see you in the next one. Bye.